Hey, what's up everyone? It's Neil here with Softmodern. Today I'm going to show you how to add a clear all option in your Nexus 7. Right now when you go up here, you don't really have a clear all feature. What I'm going to show you how to do is basically add one. Um, other devices like um, the Galaxy line has these. Other Android devices have this feature, but the Nexus doesn't, so you have to go one by one in clear apps. I'm going to show you how to do this as well as other two other methods that will make it extremely easy to clear all your running apps with with ease basically. You will need a rooted Nexus 7 as well as exposed framework so check out the article because I link out to those two guides and you will need the uh, application which you can download from Google Play. So the application is called Recent App Cleaner so let's open it up just to show you how it works. So we're going to go to Recent App pain tweaks. Now right here we're just gonna, it's already checked, it's the show clean all button. You can actually enable where it is. You can do it on the top right or top left. Let's do top left. And you may have to restart your device for this. So let's go back. Now if you see right here in the top left I have a clear all option. And all my apps are cleared. Okay so that's one way. The other way, you can also add a widget. So let's go to advanced, let's go add home screen shortcut. Just tap on it, go to your widgets, oops, that's wallpaper, go to your widgets, look for it, there it is, clean recent apps. Alright, so I have two recent apps, just tap up here on the widget three apps were cleared. Now the third and final way is to enable it to clear your recent apps when you turn your screen off. So go to advanced, sorry, go to clean preferences and go to clean when screen is off. Just check that. You can also let it just uh, leave one app or last two apps if you want, but I like to clear all. You also do clean strategy if you wanted to kill it or just or just close the app. I want it to kill it. I don't want it to run when my screen is off or anything. So let's get some apps running. Now there it is. Now let's power down. Power back up. There are no apps running. So it's really convenient and it's easy. Definitely check out the full article on Nexus 7 Softmodder. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe for more awesome videos. And thanks for watching guys.